What's up, guys? It's me, Jordan, here to Mad Vips and Belmont. No, seen anything different about the shop? That's right, Emily put a cool Christmas tree in here. We all think it's pretty sweet. So when you come in, let her know how good of a job she did on that Christmas tree, because it's pretty dope. But, otherwise, I want to show you um, my comparison between the TFE-12 and the, the TFE-12 print stick and the Bait Pin 22. So, here both of, here's both of them. We have them in each the rainbow and we have them in a few different colors to get the purple and the red or the purple with the red and black and the vape pin 20 or the tfe 12 prints stick and we have just the rainbow right now in the vape pin 22 so let's get on with this comparison so set the camera up great so starting with the print stick tfe 12 print stick it has a removable tank on it. It has TFE 12 prints sitting on top of it. That's pretty cool. You get the actual prints tank sitting on it. And then you have the stick underneath. It has a 3000 milliamp hour battery. So great battery life in my opinion. Um, it has a 8 mil tank sitting on top of it, which is TFE 12 prints, 8 mil fill of liquid. And you get this cool little drip tip on top. It is USB charged. And it's a pretty light little stick. So, moving on. We have the <clears throat> Bait Pin 22. And it is USB charged as well. Both have, this, both have the single button, five clicks on, five clicks off. Now, the difference between the Bait Pin 22 and the print stick. With the print stick, you have the removable tank. With the Bait Pin 22, it has a tank on it, but it's not a whole unscrewable tank. Only thing you can do with it is unscrew the top and the cool comes out with it and then there's your glass. Your tank is built in basically built into the mod. It also has LED lights on the bottom of it on the bottom of the underneath the o-ring so when you go to fire it it lights up whatever color o-ring you have on it. So I think it's a pretty cool addition to add. Um, the newer the newer uh, Bait Pin 22's that we got in have the mesh cools. Not saying not saying that you can't buy the mesh cools for the TFB 12 prints, but these come with the print, but the mesh cools for the Bait Pin 22 come with the Bait Pin 22. So that's pretty cool. Um, but yeah, the way you take it apart is unscrew the top. Cool, cool comes out with the top. So does the glass. And there's the three parts. Put it back together. Just slide your glass down back over top of your O-ring. Put your coil and top back down in it and screw it back on and it's five clicks on five clicks on there it goes five clicks off see how it lights up that's pretty cool Stick prints doesn't do that, so I thought that was a pretty cool difference between the two. Also, you see the size comparison. See how much taller the Prince V12 is than the stick, than the Vape Pin 22. And the drip tip difference. One is a 810 drip tip, the other is a 510 drip tip. Um, like I said, the Prince holds 8 mils of e-liquid, and the Vape Pin 22 holds... I believe it's four. It's either four or five mils of e-liquid. But the weight comparison, obviously with the big V12 on sitting on top of it, the Prince is going to be just a little more heavier than the Vape Pin 22. I mean, both are light in my opinion, but this one's just got a little bit more weight to it. Um, if I had to choose between the two. I'd choose the stick prints, the TFP 12 stick prints, just because you can remove the tank and put it on an upgraded mod. So that's my opinion. And but I do, I do like the Vape Pin 22 for its little LED light show that it puts on when you fire it. So those are my opinions. And like I said, I'd choose the prints. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Hope you liked the video. Comment which one you think you'd take. 
And until next time, my friends, this is Jordan signing off, and stay cloudy. Also, happy holidays.